Yeah, lovely people of God, this is boy Steve there. She show Shama, what about now? I want to welcome you to Gospel 101 with Steve. Okay, you can also call me Kendrick Papa. You can also call me Ken Red Carpet. Mr. Dicetta. Today, I'm introducing you a new one. The Spirit Man. Yes, Charlie. Uh, this is Nakupu Kumi. My name is Uye. Aha. All right. Okay, so Gospel 101, I keep telling you that um, I bring your favorite gospel musicians, gospel artists, gospel um, blogger, gospel presenter, gospel artist manager, anybody doing something in the gospel industry to promote the kingdom business. We bring the person closer to you. We enter into their lives. We get to know their low moments, their high moments, what inspires them to keep doing what they are doing so, so that you can appreciate them more. You understand? Uh -huh. Sometimes when you get to know these things, when you are listening to the song, you know what went into the song you are listening. You know what went into the project you are seeing. You, you appreciate the person and the, and the project more. Right. So that's why we have Gospel 101. So this year is going to be the first time or the first ever edition of Gospel 101. Yes, all the ones we've, um, we, we've um, shown uh, uh, previous ones that we shot in 20. 22. So this is the first edition, and I'm blessed to have my brother with me. Yes, when I say my brother, I'll introduce him with a song. And so let's go for a quick commercial break. We'll be back soon. See ya. Welcome back, my people. Okay, so I told you I'm going, I'm going to introduce him with a song. So um you know, my grand people. Oh, he had Oh, Anytime I listen to you, then I miss my grandma. Oh. <laughs> because um, my first encounter with you um, was your song, um, Globus. Okay. Globus okay. okay. posted okay. a song. So I saw it, I was like, bro, who is this guy? He says, Terry Dungeon. So then I had to move to your YouTube page and go through your, your songs. So one of your medleys, uh, my grandma is a girl and she's a gambaya. So when she, um, the only channel she watched was Obunu. If it's not Obunu, then forget it. The YouTube is for there. <laughs> so I was like, let me play this song for the whole lady. Mm -hmm. So I played the song for her. And she loved it. So she would call me. Call me, Batra, Batra. Until she passed. So when she passed, I was singing one of the songs with my mom. Uh, 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 um, well, you did a medley on some, some, there's this song that you, you, you did. You sang it when you came to the funeral. So um, it's like the love for you in my house is there, like the way you do your things. So I want to ask, so now I'm sure this interview they are watching because they want to know you more. <laughs> so if you say, um, Terry Johnson, are you a proper guy or who, who Terry Johnson is like? When we mention Terry Johnson, who is Terry Johnson? Okay, so first of all, I want to specially thank God for the opportunity and thank you as well for the opportunity to be here. Yes, and a special greetings to my followers, everyone who has supported in any way, as well as your viewers and listeners. God bless you so much and a special greetings to you. 
So the question, Terry Johnson. Um, so I am a guy, a dangbe, a guy, and a fancy. Oh, okay. Yes, I say that because my my dad is a guy, dangbe. His father's background is a guy, dangbe. But the father's mom, that's my grandmother, is a guy. So I grew up in a guy home. Right. Yes, a family, a guy family home. So. Um, right from childhood, right from birth, I have lived with guns for close to 29 years. And what the language we speak home is the gun. Yes. So it's like tree uh, So your mom is a fancy. My mom is fancy. Fancy and you But she's fancy from uh, Suprudu. Yes. So that means that the root is a gun. So then we have the same destiny of mind that is um, a fanti, but my mom is a girl. And my dad even speaks girl to me. Yes. So it's like, a girl, what my body come in. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> so it was girl for me. So the first song you sang, can you introduce this? Like, can you explain the song to us? Okay. Me here, in no me your da. So it means that uh, uh, I will trust him in all things. Yes, and uh, one one interesting thing about the hymns is that anytime I play them, and the Ghana language in particular, especially the Ghana language, it, it conveys a particular message you don't get in the tree, you don't get in the English. Oh, okay. Like, they have, I don't know how to say but they have deeper meanings. Uh -huh. Me, me here, you know, me here, that I'm trusting him any day, any time, whether rain or shine. In the good times and in the bad times, you see, a wage, a wage, ubake, ubahe, you know, like it's a God we all don't see, but we believe and have faith that yes, this is. So it is difficult to trust Him in all circumstances. It's very difficult. That's why we have this encouragement that hemo e e hemo e no oida. So okay, so. Um, I hope now, guys, you understand the song that he sang. It's about trusting God. So I want us to enter into his life proper now. Right. So uh, we know he's a gun now. So growing up, what was growing up for you like? Were you the Dabi person, or you were the my tap song? Uh, we force ourselves to be the Dabi. <laughs> <laughs> so let's know growing up how the family settings was. Um, how life treated you as a child? I think I think everyone's childhood um, has an impact on on you when you are when you grow up. Yeah. Yes. So the basics is childhood. I grew up in a girl family home. Yes, with um, my parents, both mom and dad, living in a chamber and hall. So uh, it wasn't that rich, rich, but they tried to make sure that. Um, I was always comfortable. Like they didn't make us. I, I'm a twin. Oh, okay. Yes. So they didn't make us. They didn't make us feel that we were that poor. But we were. We weren't rich. Okay. They tried to make sure that everything was going on. Exactly, because right from onset when we were birth, um, many back would jaya, many back would jam of ink. No for hygiene, the job we So they tried their best to treat us as such. Uh, um growing in a family house there were so many things we had to learn there were so many things you had to because you had so many people vibing with so there were so many people we had to learn so and let's let's um, talk about your primary school days to jhs to secondary level and let's move okay so in me and i in this could be and i want to shovel okay but shovel i think i i started with a uh, messy people tree Messy Pepe Tree, and then I think in primary six, I left to New Page. That was where I completed JHS. Yes, that was where I completed JHS. It's at a salam down. The school is still existing. I completed JHS, and then SS, I went to St. Thomas Aquinas. Yes, Bebe. Yeah. One of the best schools in Ghana. <laughs> is that so? <laughs> okay, so St. Thomas Aquinas. Then tertiary. Yes, so from St. Thomas Aquinas, I went to uh, KNUST, Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology. Okay, so um, you did, um, what program are you reading in secondary school? I was reading visual arts. 
Oh, yes. Yes, my passion for drawing. I'm a graphic designer too, so my passion for the things of art is next level. Uh -huh. So you did um, graphic design in tertiary? So I did, yes, I did book um, book publishing. Oh. Yes, so the course was publishing. Okay. Uh -huh. But I majored in illustration and designing. Yes. Oh, <laughs> how do I say it? Courses like this, like in Ghana, like uh, illustration, can I? She can me like that. Oh, it's good. It's good. Yeah. Sure, she can me like that. <laughs> so that's it for tertiary. Okay. And so after tertiary, I did service, national service with Ministry of Youth and Sports. From there, I I secured a job with um, Ghana Education Service, and I'm there presently. I think this is education service. What do you do there? Okay, so I'm I'm part of the dispatch unit, HRND. Yes. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, yeah, man. So today, my people, ah, you go start to Okay, so now, um, growing up, um, was any of your relatives doing music, or you are the one standing out in music? Cause you're a twin. Is your twin brother doing music or your twin sister doing music? Okay, so he's a, he's a boy. He's a boy. Yes. Why do I say he's a boy? Me, me. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, I, my my, we are the whole family is into ministry. Okay. Yes, the broader picture. My mom is a pastor. My dad is a pastor. We fellowship at Hope of Glory Bible Church. My dad, Apostle General Stephen Johnson, is the head is the founder, and my mom is the head pastor. Okay. Yes. So. Um, growing up, it's been church throughout. It's been church throughout. So yeah, that good that that good boy, pictures kid. We see you pass. Uh, yes, that that upbringing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're not supposed to go here. You're not supposed. It's always church, church, church. All we know is church. Yes. Mm -hmm. So I started playing. So you never do anything. No cutting songs. From the upbringing, the uh, good boy, clean sheet. <laughs> uh, you are not like somebody else. <laughs> uh, okay. So my my twin Perry Johnson, he he ventured into the drums, but I was doing the keyboard. And you see, if you play the keyboard over time, like the singing naturally comes. The more you do it, the more you do it. It got to a time, I think, where I actually took the music seriously was right after SHS. No, not right after SHS. I think two years before I, I completed SHS, where my my parents had a church. Okay, so there was an issue, up and forth issue. So we had to leave the church and start afresh. After doing ministry for like twenty years, we had to start afresh, and it was just myself, my twin brother, my dad, and it, it wasn't easy. We had to start under a canopy in a, a pastor's friend house. So it could rain and we are on we are we are there doing service. It's the only boy and power and more you were doing church, you won't face all. And so I gathered all that experience and I was the only person who had learned how to play the keyboard a little. Those times I had him a chum if you I had learned how to play the keyboard a little. So it was me. Standing as the keyboardist, standing as the choir master, at church was about nine as at ten. Okay. But so it means I had to be at church. I had to be playing the keyboard almost every time. I had to be singing every time. So that has been my life. Yes, and that has been my twin's life as well. Oh, okay. So then the music needed. You have no choice. I had no choice. I had, I had no choice. Then, then automatically you went. You went into ministry as in the full pastorship. Um, I'm not looking into it. I don't know what. God, the plans God has in the future, but if it is His will, fine. But Mimuele, um, <laughs> I don't know why musicians are now these days. You guys are running. Come there, some of your stuff. No, no, I mean, we are, if it is the will of God, <laughs> if, if it is the will of God. Okay, so then, we, yeah, God. Let us see if this is real. We want, we want to be like <laughs> David. We want to be Samus. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now, um, officially, you started doing music two years into, uh, after, before completion, secondary school. So now, talking about professional music, when did you realize that, okay, now 
I've sang in church for a very long time. Now I have to make it commercial that um, entire Ghanaians, aside my church, aside my mom, aside the family, like entire Ghanaians, people from Vota region can see Terry Johnson and um, um, love what he has to do for God. So I think my, my professional journey, my professional journey started in, I had my first single in 2018, okay. Draw Money. Mm -hmm. Yes, I had my first single. Can we do that? Can we do that? So, Amazing grace that saved a wretch like me, walking in victory, old Romani, old Romani. Yes, God, old Romani. Hey. Old Romani, eh, eh, old Romani song. So that's, that's the chorus wow. of the song, yes. So that was in 2018. I released that in 2018. So professionally, that was when I started doing music. How did that song go? Um, you see, it was my, my first time coming out. Coming out. So... Uh, it didn't go that well, but I believe that it was just the beginning, right. yes, for for what God was going to do with me. So I just saw it as it was just a beginning, a step in a positive direction. And right. I am happy that all things work together for me. Right. So, um, then, um, so after 2018, because I've seen a lot of uh, medleys on the games. I don't know uh, who gave you that... Um, direction to go. I don't know if you had this Anglican uh, Methodist background because all the songs you normally do are this Anglican mm -hmm. Anglican background. Uh, so about the medleys, what actually pushed me or inspired me to do that was uh, it got to a time I think um, uh, all my life I have been planning to join either the army or the immigration. People okay. keep telling me because of my height, Terry, join the army, join the army. And I'm very tall. <laughs> oh, okay. So it got to a point um, I wasn't getting the opportunity to join. So it got me frustrated. And I had this uh, ministry gift. But there was a time I had to go and wait on the Lord. Yes. I had to go and wait on the Lord for a week. So I was there praying, 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 praying. And then the Lord dropped this idea that why don't you bridge the gap? So the, the whole purpose is to bridge the gap between the charismatic and the orthodox, where most of the hymns and are there. sung. Yes. Only at the orthodox. Yes, I sang at the Anglican, except but for a few. So I said, oh, no, this is a brilliant idea. And I had people on board who were willing to help me. There's a, a special thanks to Bernard, Bernard Ako. He's been, he's been a great support, yes, he's been a great support. So, God bless you, boss. So he, he, he also, after sharing this idea with him, was like, oh, it's a good thing to do, so let's just start work and then it, it wasn't easy and um, there are most of the songs i never knew how to sing but you see the the anglican and the methodist hymns since old they were written and they still carry power and so anytime i hear them it changes like it changes me totally it changes me totally so that that has been the journey for the medley Yes, and so we were doing it often, we were doing it often. And Shikale, Shikaba, We were looking at, it wasn't about the money, but it was about blessing lives, letting people understand um, what, what, what they are singing, whatever they are singing, they should, they should be educated. It, 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 it's sad, see, you are making an impact. Yes, I think for, for some of us who didn't see it, then call you. Because after you made this step, a lot of people called me on the phone. Called me, maybe local, maybe going. Even they concentrate on the balance. But 
then I have to give them your, your YouTube channel for them okay. to go and see the, 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 the videos. You are making an impact. The only challenge is that the gun language. Fine, on the gospel space, the guns are ahead. They have the platform on the gospel space because most of the people making wave in the gospel industry now are guns. Right. But um, Ghanaians, for some reason, don't like the language. I don't know if it's, if it's a key. Like, hey. yeah. uh, Ghanaians, for some reasons, the language they don't like. I don't know what the problem is or where the problem is, but they don't like the language. So do you feel that um, people are not noticing you more because of the language that you use? Oh, I, for that, I believe that um, when it comes to my content, then uh, I believe the guys are doing so well for me. So well for me, no two ways about that. Because anytime I post, the number of shares I get on the video. Like, so, it's like gun songs, uh, although there are people doing gun songs, but then you see the kind of content I'm putting out there. These are the old songs the old ladies know. These are the old songs the young guys heard Lame. their Lame. old ladies. Lame. Yeah, so they have come to love that song. And so anytime I put them out there, they feel, ah, these are songs. We want these are songs we want, so they push it. So for me, the gang content, not just the gang content, but the hymns I do, the the guys really support me, and I really, I really appreciate their support. I really appreciate their support. So do you know that uh, as it stands now, now you are you are, you are claiming ownership of the gang songs, especially <laughs> the hymns, because uh, sometimes uh, 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 there are songs written, but sometimes you don't know the others. Yeah. Yeah. The hymns you don't know there was some of them, they are dead. And even their children didn't know that their daddy or um their like their parents did this kind of song. Mm -hmm. So as it stands now, most of the songs are going to be registered in your name. I don't know if you um I think most of the songs I do, yes, to to clarify some few things. Mm -hmm. Most of the songs I do are domain songs and they are they are hymns. So in as much as I sing them, I make sure that I put the hymn number there so that you know that, oh, this is the hymn. I go to the hymn book and then I find it in the hymn book and then I can sing along. Uh -huh. So most of them are domain songs. For those that are not domain songs, I acknowledge them as such and say that, oh, I own no rights to the songs and then state the original, okay. yes, author of the okay, song. It's a, it's a good job you are doing. So <laughs> I pray that um, my gang people, um, I know you people, when you say you're supporting, you're supporting. And I know when you say, I'm a Hey, bro, I'm a I'm a Hey, bro, I'm a Hey, bro, I'm a Hey, bro, I'm a I'm a Hey, bro, I'm a Hey, bro, I'm a Because I see um, Apostle Abraham Lamptey yeah. started saying certain things about guns, but they had issues with him. But he was telling after the truth. Mm -hmm. See, one gun man will travel and he's the only person. But the one that's man will travel and you see, that is the thing. So we are praying that this time around, um, the gang people, uh, Papa making in the home, on solar case in the van more on the main room because no need to money to own. He's selling the Ghanaian language, the Ghana language to to the people, and the way you are doing it, the content fixing fusing the content with the orthodox yeah. is making a lot of sense. So God bless you for doing that. Mm -hmm. So now let's watch the future for the regions. Do you want to do original songs now? Um, do you want to do some features? Yes. So, um, when it comes to original songs, yes, I have plans for them. But as as uh, we see, everything takes time. Yes. But in the future, uh, I, very soon I'll be releasing an original song. Yes, a single. Uh, yes. For my girl people. It's going to be the same way. Oh, no, it's, it's a danceable song. Oh. A very danceable song. And I hope they love it. I, mean, I, I, want, I want to see you on a play song. How you are going to? You see, oh, the dancing is my problem. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no. Somebody you grew, you grew up in a girl community. You see, I grew in a girl community, but we're always in your work and we're done. Never actually, never actually. So, Come on, just pop What do I put in Jenny? Wah, wah, wah! Shop of you, no put in Jatau. Next door neighbor, but some mommy ake. Hey, Obi and Nye make it be. Obi and Nye make it be because henna afford. Yeah, if we are not careful, eh? Like, where is the um, community? Like, so, asalam down. 
or you see hey, I sat them down. So the kind of people we were mingling with, others were like, oh, no, 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 this is bad influence. So it was always indoor. It was Joel. Eh? Mm. She was like, I you are that. No, when you can come, you can't go. Oh, you can't go. 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 So I'm, I'm yet to see this proper cause. God, what do I don't, I don't know why any then you allow us for then then. Oh no, oh no, Okay, so we are we are hoping for um, a new single release from yeah. maybe either book kind of. Yes, so it's not just a single, but I'm looking at doing um, a few other projects as well. Any um, features? Yes, um, I'm looking at some few. Um, artists in the ministry, in the gospel field, who who really support what I'm doing and are in the gang space for now. So like gangs like, let's give us some names to that we should. Because oh. when you mention that, when you mention that name, I, I can tell you how the song is going to look like. Um, I, the, the truth of the matter is, I'm still praying about it. What? Yes, I'm still praying about but it. But people you wish, like maybe, looking at, um, me need to do, I feel like I can do, look at cow. I feel like I can do something with Carl. Looking at the way he does his things, I feel like I'm. Oh, yeah. as I said, I'm praying about it. Oh, yes, that's more trouble. This kind of thing, this kind of thing, you, you, you have to be led. You right. see, uh -huh. I know that I know the content they put out. I know what they are doing to promote the guy. They are all in the guy terrain, but you have to you have to pray about it and then know that oh, this is the right person God wants you. To do if I have decided on that, oh, why not? I'll share with you, right. yes, but very soon, very soon. Okay, very soon. Yeah, yeah. These people, when they say very soon, they are here. Okay, so then let, let me ask you this question. Sam. <laughs> you're in the gospel industry space, um, people think that um, the guns yeah, it's like you guys are um, uh, content with where you are, like you show now, Jamie Line, you know, Mamprovi Line, you know, guys are happy that guys don't bring your project out. Like the other people are doing. Mm -hmm. Do you believe that? Um, I don't believe that. I believe that I believe that there are people, it's not just in the gang space, but in the Akan space, in the Ewa space. This kind of ministry, this ministry thing, it is money. It is investment. Not no, le, let me not say money, but it is investment and taking the decision because they are they are bigger people ahead or mightier people ahead who are doing extremely great mentioning joe metal minister joe metal mentioning kawaklote mr kawaklote mentioning other few gang people who are doing Luigi, very great Luigi, Luigi yeah. mclean they are putting the gang out there bononia is everywhere uh -huh. so i uh, sometimes they hear me okay shikane gule hewale uh -huh. so, so, so you believe that maybe the main challenge for the gang community is the, the finance. But there is time and there. Yes, some people have the money, but investing into it is a problem. <laughs> they feel like when they do one, they do two. And as I said, it's not just, it's not just with the guns. There are three people who also do the same. Uh -huh. Somebody is saying that, I can't even ask you, can't even ask you to ask me, can't fly back to our school, like this woman and this guy. New like it's you get new automatically and this account. So it's like you guys don't break out. See, do you what I mean? It's like all your program is around, but at least we'll break it out. Then you bring somebody outside your three. So it's like then okay, then somebody hears about you out there. You get it. And sometimes if maybe you are invited far. So it's like breaking now. That's yeah. what I'm trying to do. Okay, breaking barriers. I, I believe that 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 uh, is one thing we should all look at because that is why on my page it's not just the gang content I do. I do the tree content as well, and they are also 
extremely excited about whatever I put out there for them. Okay. So it's about breaking barriers. Yes, we are not um, you, the individual putting the project out there. It is not about just the gun, but you're looking at the bigger picture. We are trying to preach Christ. We are trying to convey that message. So whichever way, not just gun, whichever way you, you can convey the message, you should do well to convey it. So it's not just the gun. Okay, so let me ask you this question. How do you see the gospel industry, the Ghanaian gospel industry now? <laughs> so we are, going to, we are going to take how you see it now. Um, what do you think should change? What do you think you should do? Hey. <laughs> okay, so I'm up and coming. Yes. Mm-hmm. So I'm just going to share a little thought about it. Mm-hmm. I believe that those ahead are doing a very great job by supporting a few people. You see, um, at first I had the notion that, let me be honest, I had the notion that those are the top. Don't like supporting them. Do not like supporting. But the thing is, if you are making an impact, they'll see you. They will see you. And they will want to help you. So if you're, you're not making that impact, like, Definitely, they won't. So then, then they, 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 we are one people. Okay, I don't put a book. So, like, uh-huh. so, so, if you only make the impact, right. they would want to help you because they won't be there forever. So they would want to bring up new generation, and I believe that most of them are doing that. Yes, and it's it's a credit to them. God bless them so much for helping with the upcoming. God bless them so much. God bless them so much. So, um. That is it. <laughs> so what, what do you want to add to the industry? Like you feel like the industry should be doing this, watching this space. I feel like at this time, um, the gospel industry, this and this and this, if we are to do it, it's going to help us more. Um, I believe that, I believe that everyone has um, a role to play. Everyone has a role to play. And for the gospel industry, the the you so <laughs> this this issue this issue also I don't <laughs> <laughs> oh <laughs> my <laughs> pastor please permit me why nah, he wants to put me in a in a tight <laughs> or maybe there are some ideas that I want to bring on board then we oh no I say it I, I can trumpet it at the moment at the moment I think I think they are doing a good job I think they are doing a good job. You see, if sometimes people would like to do the comparison, um, looking at the Nigeria artist and the, the Ghanaian, Ghanaian artist, the Ghanaian gospel artist, but you're looking at them, they have numbers, they have huge numbers. So, your one is like their hundred. When one person watches here, over 100 people have watched there. So, if that competition comes in, it makes no sense. But then I feel that we should just keep doing what we are doing. And when the right time comes, you guys keep singing their songs too. On events, you enter into a Christian concert, and ninety percent of the songs sung there. Are not you see, there are many. So the moment they put their content out there, and it's a good one, and it it blows. Why but is it that when they are writing songs, they write simple songs for you to learn? But we also write simple songs to be too cool. Simple. <laughs> See, simple song, but when a Ghanaian is writing a song, B flat, flat, low, so do do, plenty, 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 plenty. Oh, one have... one song, mm-hmm. verse, chorus, verse, another verse, bridge, third verse. I don't know, they are running. So. <laughs> do, do you get it? Okay, so and so the, it is important. Good. And the production, Nigerian will give you a simple production that every keyboard is will play. That is that's how come when you are, when you enter into their um, a concert, you want to raise their songs because it's simple for them to learn. Yeah. But these new songs that are coming, you cannot raise them mm-hmm. because when you raise, the keyboardists will find themselves wanting. You yeah, understand? Yeah. Uh-huh. So if we are to tone down a little bit, give them the simple songs, then maybe on one or two songs on your album, you can give your classic. 
and have to show that yes, we can do it, but we can want to serve the people, make the people understand. So that's true. That's true. Because with gospel mi- mi- music and um, the gospel ministry, it is all about propagating the gospel. So if the person listening or watching you is not able to understand what is going on, then it makes no sense because it should it should be broken down to the layman. The lay person to say that oh in a man mala into me man mala into me so I think that is what some of us should be looking at. Uh-huh. We should make it simple for the lay person, but because if you are if you are working with um, instrumentalists, like they also have their way of thinking. Oh, be tall, taller. <laughs> so, mm, <laughs> what should we disturb us? <laughs> so it is up to you, the artist, to make sure that whatever they are playing. Eh, should come down. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So, okay, I, I, I knew it would come to this question. <laughs> I knew, I knew. <laughs> so, I'm just as single as you. Sure. Mm. Are you married? No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know, so we'll keep it. <laughs> okay. So, are you are you are you ready to mingle? Oh, I'm still. So the thing is, I'm I'm still looking for the the flesh of my flesh and the bone of my bone so people can send the application um oh why not they are free to send it but uh, it is up to me <laughs> to decide oh it was, it was up to adam when he woke up from his slumber that was when he said ah this is this is okay what so I on want. that note on that note do you have any specific that we are watching that. So when I see one, I say, hey, this is Terry Johnson Speckle. So that I can't help. Have you contacted him yet? Maybe <laughs> <laughs> uh, because I, I know I know um, Ken Speck. So when I see one, I say, okay, this one there, Ken will like. Uh-huh. I believe that, I believe that with the gospel space, we are not just looking at getting married to all the beauties is equally important, but we are looking at character. We are looking at someone who who understand what you are doing. So, and um, beyond the beauty, I think that is that is what I'm looking out for: the character, and then someone who understand whatever I'm doing. Because this ministry thing, um, there are times that you 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 would have to mingle with a lot of opposite sex. Right. Yes, and you need someone. Who will be understanding? Go, oh, 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 your program put in jail. Sometimes put in jail, they can't go by. So I'm looking out for that and not a mene and again, mene and again. I'm not fan of that. You keep on the corner, nine spine gentleman, and you only hear me. Look, yes, you have a pal, and you can send an application. Maybe you can do it through me, I'll link you up. Okay, so let's do this guy, one guy song. So give us any any of your your names then. Me balala, be mi dale, ma ba mi da nyomo shi, shi mi nibi, fe kwa mi le, oh, mi na boni emli. Su my song keke yo em e na mi e tri da da e he mi mi e ba e no kwale la be na be mi mi fe ye na be this is the word of the Lord unto you. Things, things in this season isn't easy. Things are not going well. But this is his word unto you. Oh, group on ke, efijile, ha e bibile, ano, na kaimi, minyomo nine, ha mi hu e bile no. Beni mi yo mi nye musum, ne nyongo fa ake mi ba, 
Que bang bene bile no e se mo na lo tutu o mi ri fe ye na gbe ku nyo mo su mo da e yo this song i'm dedicating this song to my mom and my auntie, um, auntie Naomi Adote, she's ad, uh, Naomi Adote on Facebook. She's a lover of your music. And, and, and this is job. Uh, she came from UK for the, for the funeral, but she's gone. Oh! So look for her. I think she'll be always commenting on your. She's a great supporter of gospel music, so look for her. Auntie Naomi, I'll look for you. She loves, she loves your music. God bless you. Uh-huh. So, guys. Um, I wish we could continue, but time. So let us let us know your, your handles from YouTube to YouTube. Okay. So I think across all net, across all social media handles, I use Terry Johnson. You type Terry Johnson on Facebook, you get me. You type Terry Johnson on Instagram, you get me. You, get me. you type Terry Johnson underscore official on TikTok, you get me. And on audio mark Terry Johnson iTunes everywhere, Terry Johnson. But on YouTube, it's Terry Johnson GH. No, I think it's Terry Johnson as well, yes. So Terry Johnson, please go there, share, like, comment, do whatever you want to do there. God bless you. <laughs> Alright, so um, the platforms are there, Terry Johnson everywhere. On YouTube is Terry Johnson, um, Terry Johnson, and TikTok is Terry Johnson underscore official. Uh, but aside that, the Facebook, every place, Terry, Terry Johnson. Johnson. So just um, follow, follow him and Listen to his music. His music, I don't know, it's something else. Uh, yes, because I, I like playing them. I like listening to them. Right. Okay. So um, you know our channel already. This is Gospel One Hundred One. Gospel One Hundred One. So the Ghana people watching for the first time. This is Gospel One Hundred One. And my name is Steve. You can also call me the She 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 Man. You can also call me Ken Rekka. You can also call me Ken You can also call me Mister Dissector. Eh? Now the Spirit Man. Okay. So this channel on YouTube. Is OS TV GH, OS TV GH, on YouTube OS TV GH. Please subscribe. So um, I- I'm sure um, the father of Ted Johnson is watching. The mother is watching. The twin brother is watching. So subscribe, please. Uh-huh. And the fans of Ted Johnson, please subscribe. Right. Then on Instagram, it's OS TV underscore GH, OS TV underscore GH. On Facebook, it's just OS TV. Right. So follow me. We have a lot of content for you like this. Like this for you. And this year we have amazing things. This year I'm the same in an interview. It's not kind of there. Back to back, back to back, back to back. Yes, yes, yes. So God bless you for coming there. God bless you too. Bless your last you. message for your people then. Um I want to I want to I want to say that um as I stated earlier, we're in difficult times, but we are trusting God to keep us safe. Yes. Um whatever you are going through, God is in it. And everything will be fine. God bless you so much. Okay, so let's do this. Thank you, sir. God bless you. 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 God b